So there we are. Now let's see if this works. Okay, cool. So audio is working. I'm seeing that my camera is a bit wonky. Okay. Now let's see. Time to find a way to get this working on it. I have the feeling that my microphone is way too far away. So let me get that a bit closer so you can hear me a bit better. Um, go down a bit. I hope that's a lot better. Yeah, that's a lot better. Just let me know if it's uh, if the audio is okay. If it isn't, then please let me know. I don't want to blow up your speakers. And I see that P to the B is following me now as well. So that's great. Um, let's see how hard this goes. Uh, it's probably is hard at least for me i don't know how it is for you if you feel that the levels are not correct because i'm still trying to figure out how to um, get them just right please let me know and i'll uh, i'll try to uh, get some stuff out so oh no. it's been a while since i've been working on this track so i need to uh I need to listen through it all and uh, then you can hear it as well. And then let's see what we can do with this bass over here. So yeah, here he goes. Don't forget to follow me.
Thank you, Kyle370. Thank you very much for the follow. Good evening. Yeah, I think that's uh, that's good. <clears throat> um, there, I did notice that I need to do something over here. Because I have uh, this part doing its thing. <clears throat> and then I've got this part doing its thing. I think I need something here. Um, let's see. I was also wondering if I could... Uh, these two. I wonder what happens if I um, move this one in a different direction. See what happens. Because now, I have to think about what I'm doing now. Mm. This one's going up. Um, hold on, I think I need to pick this one. I have no idea what I'm doing, so. Ah, that's not working. Um, because this is a G, that's also a G. I made it from a G to a G. Hold on. Um, what about the G? No, that's not gonna work. I need two in between. Hold on. I think that's a bit too low for this. Hmm. Okay, that's not gonna work. Um, I do wonder. Hold on. Okay, well, it works. Um. I wonder why this isn't really pumping through like I want it to. Hmm. Oh, wait, hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Um, um, this might be it. to get this out and put the LFO tool in there. Uh, no, kickstart. See how that sounds. 
I need to do that before there. This is maybe a bit too much, but we'll see. down to mono first. Why is it still on here? Ah, yeah. Okay, mm. so when it's need. Needs to stay there. 
No. Come on. Go away there and there. Do this and this. Sounds a bit better, I think. I think at least. Basically, I should do a a B test for this. Why didn't I do that before? So we go back to this one. We turn. We throw this one off from somewhere. No, the top one. Then do this. Turn this back on. Turn this off. Oh wait, no. Let this. Let's stay on. Um, so now we have the old one. Okay, so that's the old one. And the only thing that's still different is this one. And we need to change that to those. I think that was everything I did. Yeah. Hold on. Sounds weird. Where is it coming from? Oh, it's because I have another another synth, of course. Um, this one's a bit tighter, I think. <laughs> um. Basically, just for a bit of body. That's what I, that, what they told me. You don't want to make this up, but you want to take a bit of this, make it a bit louder. You have a bit more dynamic in the bass. Okay, I can see why that's why that's cleaner. Oh, 
That was not what I wanted. Yeah, that's clashing. Yeah, I think I'll leave it at that one. I'm gonna take this sub out. So now we have the good one left. Now it's just a matter of trying to get this a bit more boomy. Now I have something that I could use, and I heard that other people use it as well. Just don't need to drown out everything. Okay, so how does the sound together? It's a bit too gritty. When it's here, you hear the, the vibrations. Okay, it's a little bit better. So now if I hear everything from the start, oh, from there. Now I'm wondering. Okay, it's not re-triggering. So first off, I need to re-trigger this. Oh, why is it doing that? It's not re-triggering. How did you turn it? Do you turn it off? Oh, wait, there was a random thing. No, it's not that. <laughs> oh, yeah, of course. Uh, 
that's the thing. Okay, so... <clears throat> Oh god. Okay, so now that I got that I can try something different. Let's roll. Let's see how this sounds. Oh who knows? Let's see how this sounds. Now I need to see that this is this. That's what happens if I do this? Because now you have uh, one baseline, and then the the sub bass. Let's see how that sounds. How does it sound with the kick? Okay, it doesn't sound bad, but I think it's not the way I should go. Mm. There we go. I wonder if... Um, <laughs> yay. Now I need to do it. Redo it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I just screwed myself. Oh. Hold on. Hold on. I wonder what this will sound like. No. Do I have to be three? It does have a nice ring to it, to be honest. Okay, this looks really weird. Okay, let's hear that together with the rest. Oh, you can really hear the difference between those. Is a far more rumbly so uh, sub here. Yeah, now let's see what happens.
it does really give a more intense feeler. I, I don't know, it, it, it blows it up a little bit more. And this may have a beneficial effect because now I can do something like uh, this again. I think it was 16 and 10. Sounds good. Has a lot to do with this. That's good. Because now you get the. That's really good. I need to kill that attack. Sounds really... <laughs> really bad though. <laughs> I need to kill. No, I don't need to kill. Oh my god, that's the difference. Oh! There's so much difference there. Damn, should have done this a lot earlier. Okay, so this, these two, I need to, <coughs> need to loop. A loop de loop, and then you can get that. That's okay. I just need to get rid of the attack in this one. If that attack is gone, I'm golden. Wait, I need to change the attack dynamically. Well, shit. Because now, when it 
enters in this part. Okay, so I need to change this attack. Nope. Oh yeah, I do. Turn around this point, I believe. No, it's gonna be faster. Okay, I think this is good. So I can get that attack. Um, why do I see these weird lines? What's this? I don't understand. What's going on? I, I don't get what it, what are these lines? Wait, okay, never mind then. There. No. from there. Wait, I can do it there. Cool. Let's see. Um, so I changed those. Then I need to have the attack back up over here. Oh, back down, I mean. Where, where is it there? 44. That's good. Um, and then I have to pick this one. Nope, not that one. I need to have this one. There we go. And one extra. So now let's see how this sounds. <laughs> Sounds pretty good. Now I wonder, why is this thing doing this? I think it's a bit too loud now. Oh, 
it is. Sounds better. Hmm, let's hear this in kick and... Hey, Conquest. Welcome. Hope my voice is coming over the music, because last time with the F1 I heard that it's not. <laughs> Good. And I finally figured out how I can um, get a better bass. Um, Because if you um, uh, let me let me let me get that back. Let's see if I can get it here. Nope. Don't do this. Okay. Um. Let's see. I can think. I think I can do this. Sound. Sound. Cloud. There we go. My latest version, mm, let's see, tracks, no, playlist, 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 production work, there we go. This was my latest version. And be especially notable for the sub bass. Because I made a mistake somewhere. It's coming in now. And I felt like it's not really consistent. Um, it's not really giving that oomph constantly. Um, Basically, what I had was this. You can hear already, it's like it's constantly moving. You can even see it here uh, that it's like dipping, coming up. And I was try trying, like, I need to get that fixed. And I finally found out what it was because um, it was the frequencies um, playing with each other. Because I have 16 voices and 10 voices. So I was like, yay! I finally found it because when I pulled them down to one, it suddenly became apparent that it that fixed the whole issue. But I was tweaking the sound and I found a better sub bass sound for it. So that's what you heard now. Um, and then I just made this as a sub bass, just every sixteenth, I believe. Yeah, every sixteenth is a note. So basically, you hear this. And if I turn the uh, kickstart off, it's nothing more than this. So when I turn that on, it sounds like something. And I can let you hear the difference between this one. Um, so only the bass and the kick. You hear this compared to what you hear in the next section. It's still there, but you occasionally hear it. So now the, the normal bass comes back. So now you can really hear that difference. So yeah, now I have the... Um, I set the, the whole uh, attack had to be at zero 
for this to work. Oh. And then I, I pull the attack up, uh, attack down. So an eye up. So the attack goes, uh, becomes longer. And then after this, you get the nice uh, okay, I need it needs to turn off the um, this one. There we go. <clears throat> so now you have this, and then you get the nice vibrating and alternating waves for the bass. I let that flow until this uh, until the um, the side chain comes back. And it all sounds great. So if I go further on. Now you have a really a bit bigger bass sound in the back. And then it's back. So together. I do think I may need to up the volume a bit to give it even more presence. And maybe even change it up a bit so, because um, maybe this is a bit too loud at the moment. So maybe uh, on the volume, just. Um, Oh, come on, where are you? Mixer, there you go, track volume. So maybe I should um, lower this a bit and make this part a bit higher. It was on six, now on seven. Take it on seven. You can pick this up. Um, let's see. I may have to put this down. No, oh, there. Seven. It was. There we go. <clears throat> Yeah, that's much better. Now it's much more in the front. Maybe not that high, maybe a bit lower, but sounds good already. Okay, sounds great. Sounds really great. Really happy with this. Um, I really like that intro. I really do.
So uh, the only thing I noticed when I was playing through it, um, maybe this section I need to do something. But um, I don't know if you're willing to conquest, but if you have the time, um, I can play the whole track. And if you hear something that you say like, hey, maybe you should do something over there, then um, if you have the time, do you have, uh, are you willing to do that for me? Well, you know what? I'll just play. Maybe I can hear something for myself. this sound ah uh, that one okay that's good
Okay, I need a reference track for now. Um, let's see if I can go progressive, trance. I don't know. No, not pink, please. No, no, not, not, uh, well, okay. <laughs> Fine. Wait, this is not progressive trance. This is just almost side trance. Hold on. You do. <laughs> yeah, that's that's true. Like I have a mastering rack, but it's even turned off right now. Cause if I play it like this, like this, but then if I turn it on, it gets a little more dynamic. It sounds like like something. Some things are a bit better. Hold on for a minute. Okay, okay, okay. Um, just wait a minute. Okay, I'll wait. A, I, I think it's been a minute. Is it? It's been a minute, right? Don't know exactly what you're planning.
Yeah, I definitely need something here. I need something, but I don't really, I don't really know what exactly. It's weird. I don't know. Let's see. Do I have any weird stuff? Mm. Samples. and stuff loop master weird stuff Whoosh. <laughs> Nice. Dreaming space bats. Conquest, do you have anything you would add to the track? I wonder, <laughs> would a violin do something? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I can enter a violin to it, but I think that's too much melodic stuff for a progressive track. Though I don't only have 
one type of uh, you can pick the role the baseline for it but I think I only have one like this is my only melodic stuff maybe you can pick this with it but hmm Hold on. No, oh, wait. Wait, did it crash or? Wait, what? Why am I not hearing anything? What's go? Oh, that's the. Oh, okay. Who knows? We'll just see what happens. Um, I'll pick these. Just put these there. I have no clue how it's gonna be sounding. Shit, <laughs> it's going too high. <laughs> oh no. Um, I believe it was all an A. This is D. Well, shit. Mm. And it's all, all white notes. Okay, that's cool. Um, let me think, let me think, let me think. Um, I need to pull all this shit down. Hmm. Okay, hold on. Oh, wait. Is everything still working? It looks like it. Okay. My uh, stream window just stopped working. Or at least a preview. Well, there we are. Okay. Um, let's see, we can um, probably If we need to move these down to E, there. Whoop. Damn, that's up far. That's far down. Um. So we can. Hmm. This is one octave higher. That's two octaves higher. Ah, oh, wait. Maybe I have an idea. Don't know if it will work, but who knows. Well, oh, shit. It looks like it could work. I don't know. Oh, that's not good. Don't know if that's the correct one. Ooh, that sounds beautiful. Whoop. And let's see, that's the D. So we need one. Don't think that's how it works. Uh, 
No, this is not gonna work. I think I have enough melodic stuff. It could be more like little effects, but I don't really know what to add. I'll just go here and no, thank you. Um, let's see. Um, what should I do? What should I do? What should I do? Um, progress. Nope. Nope. Progressive. Trans. Tran. Trans. There you go. <clears throat> Let's see. Um, that's a progressive trans mix. Japanese trans and progressive. Nice. Since when does... Since when does YouTube make it possible for you to buy music albums? That's weird. Never heard that before. Oh, come on. I'm not gonna show you guys. Okay, hold on. Let's do it like this. Um. Ah, uh, no, it's not gonna work. Ah, uh, damn, damn, damn. Mm. I really need to do it through here. Um, progressive. Oh wait, I can also do it like this. Beatboard.com. Let's see if we can get some tracks from there. No, no, you don't. No, you don't have to. We're just going to go to trance. Say tracks, progressive tracks, subgenre, sub sub subgenre, progressive. There we go. Let's see if we can get some popular DJ from here somewhere. BT, yeah, that's always good. Raphael Osmo, that could be something. Not much effects in here as well. Okay, so this one hasn't have any effects in it, or at least not lo not a lot. So that's good. Larry Nielsen is a bit. It's not Hold on. Not much effects in there either. So yeah, I think I'm good. <laughs> Um, yeah, I, I think this is what I want to send into the demo drop to uh, Wednesday. I really don't know what to add. <clears throat> I really don't. I really don't know what to add. I think so too. I think so. It, it must be, right? I mean, it has bass now. Come on. It has bass. Like, it has bass. You can't deny it has bass. Wait, why am I not hearing anything? 
Hold on. What's going on here? Wait, 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 wait. Why? Oh! Ah, that's why I didn't hear anything. But come on, it has base now. You cannot deny it has base. You could say it might even have a little bit too much. I still think I need to put this down a little bit. I do think this might be a bit it can be this can be a bit more apparent. I think I need to have a filter in there. I think it's the cutoff that I have. really know what it is then mm -mm -mm -mm. though not really too much of a problem uh, let's see better for it. Let's see if I can do something here. Oh, come on. Ah, that little boost. Sounds good. A little sub boost. Hold on. Okay. Does this also have a little? I think this is uh, pretty good. Well, maybe there is one thing that I could add. Maybe there is a, um, a bit more of a mid range baseline that I could put in there so that, well, yeah because I don't have I don't really have a mid base you could say that it's this one 
And this uh, this even has the mid mid section. But it sounds more low. Maybe I have a high bass. That even is a thing, but who knows? Let's see. Let's put this one in there. Um let's see if we have some bass line that could be part of this track. It's maybe a two flowy. Three triggering, trigger, trigger. Who knows? Let's see if we can put this there. Wait. Doesn't sound that weird, does it? Hold on. Why do I copy the wrong ones every time? There we go. <clears throat> Could I turn this around? I wonder if this <coughs> it could work. I don't know. Um, it starts with two. Yeah, okay, that's good. There we go. My shit. Okay, so. And we just need to have this in there. Make a cutoff. It's literally that only little frequency there. How funny is that? <laughs> nice. Okay. Now we can move this down to, I think, minus seven. Let's see if we can do something like this. Let's see what happens. No. Uh, no, that won't do. Okay, let's see. Will it be good? Will it sound good? I don't know, we'll see. sound good doesn't it at least when I'm I 
try to listen to the track uh, while do something, doing something else, and then see if it, if you notice it. I noticed it, but that was when I looked up. When you remove it, you hear it. Sounds good. Can 
be a bit more back. Maybe I need to drown it or something in uh in some delay. I, oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh which one is it? Okay, this has a delay. Wait. Uh -huh. Oh this 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 one. It can have a bit of a delay, but I don't think reverb would be the best. I can check. I don't think this is it. Okay, so that sounds pretty good. Now I wonder if I can find my... Um, let's see if I can find... Uh, there is one... There is one plugin. Oh. Well, that sucks. There's one plugin for basically only. Um, uh, which one is it? It's the Oracle. Yay! I wonder how this sounds. Oh, 
that reverb is way too big. Or that, yeah, the reverb. Hold on. Might be better. Hey, ch hey, uh, Stack, how you doing? How are you doing? Might turn this off though. Let's see how that sounds. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Hey, I'm good, man. I'm really good. As you see, I'm uh, fully back into it. Okay, so um, let's see, I'll just do this. Okay, um, I'll let you hear the full track. Um, I did a lot of stuff on the, um, on the bass, um, or a lot. I changed some things and I found a little mistake that um, I think you can still hear it though, if you, have this here. I'll just let you hear this. Um, I changed the sound of the bass a little bit, but um, if you hear this, don't mind that this is too loud, but I found out that this was basically the problem because what happened is that um, I had, or still have, but changed something. Um, I have 16 voices and 10 voices on my two synths and on my oscillators. But because of that, you get that sound. And because I was using that sound with a side chain, you got a bit of well you got the good bass and you got a bad bass and you can even hear it if i do this just just hear the difference i, don't, I can turn off this one and this one down. hear the difference between no bass the new bass and the old bass wait i'll do it a different way i'll do this and you can hear the old bass and then the new bass so um no bass. Here comes the bass. You already hear that it's dipping. Oh, hold on. It says it has the uh, kickstart was out. Was off. Hold on. Device on. Put it on, there we go, there we go. <clears throat> you can already hear that there's, sometimes there's bass, sometimes there's not. So now comes the new bass. And now it keeps consistent. I consistently have to have a base. And what really helped with that was that the, um, let's turn this off. This is what you hear in that other base because I, I used a full note in the, the full section. It didn't start over. So you hear this. 
can also see it in the uh, compressor that it's wobbling. Like, sometimes it's a bit louder, sometimes it's a bit lower. I try to use the compressor to make it level, but you'll still hear that that waving sound. So when I found out that that was the case, what I basically did was make 16th notes all the way through. And when you hear that without the compressor on or without kickstart, you get this. Hold on, let's turn that off. Pretty consistent. And when you turn kickstart on, you get a really consistent uh, rolling bass. And then you just turn off the kickstart and um, so you come in from this. And then I uh, up the attack. So the next part, like if I had the attack the same as this one, you constantly hear whoop, whoop, whoop. And now it's just a nice. Nicely flowing. So now you're getting into it. And then, and I leave that on until uh, we get to the drop over here in this section, um, where I change back from the, the big notes to the uh, 16th. And then the kickstart comes on again and you have the rolling bass again. So when I, when I pick this part, So yeah, I really hope that will give the track a bit more oomph when I uh, listen to it in other settings. So yeah, and I don't know what to add anymore. I, I was like, I may, I, I could fill it up. I, I picked some tracks that I found uh, on Beatport. So yeah, um, I'll, I'll just let you listen to the whole track. And if you say like you have something um, that you could add, let me know. Um, I'll just let it play and uh, talk to you on the other end. <laughs>
So, my track. I'm probably gonna export it. It's been going on for two hours now, so. Uh... Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, I I'm. I think I'm gonna leave it for now. Um. Maybe gonna play a game or something, and then um, I'll see what um, I'll see tomorrow. I'll go back with some fresh ears, and uh, and indeed try to see if I can add something to the um, to the drop. Maybe you need some some extra plugs or something that ping through, but we'll see tomorrow uh, tomorrow evening. I'm I'm at least very happy with what I have now. It's. Uh, Almost at a point that I think it's it's gonna be some uh, something that I can release. I think I could release it already if I wanted to with some label, but I want to have it have a good track. So, so yeah. Um, yeah tomorrow is the final uh, final day, and then I'm gonna go over to Mark Six now, Six Mas, uh channel. Let's see what he has to say. So yeah, that's uh that's gonna be it for today. I'm gonna save it as a new project. Of course. Can't save it. Come on. Save save. Save life set. S version nine. Wait, oh. Um version nine is a fact, and I'm gonna export that as well. Export audio. Uh, make sure it's from one to two. That's good. Mm, I think it's over here. Yeah, at the beginning. Exports. Version nine. Save. Well then, um, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for being here, Stack uh, and uh, Conquest. If you're still uh, out there, then uh, you as well. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, if by any chance. You have a weird dream thinking about me and my track and you're like, hey, that you should add that, then come back tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow night I'll be streaming again. I'm uh, laying everything I have to do on my chores uh, to the side. Have fun, uh, Stack. 
do your thing and uh, good luck with your uh, with your course. So yeah, I'll uh, I'll let this export for now and um, I'm gonna turn off the stream and I'll see you guys. <laughs> oh, it's been such a long day. Uh, working for uh, eight hours and then here. But we made progress. Anyway, see you in the uh, next uh, episode of uh, Studio Sessions. <laughs> so um, have a good night and I'll see you again tomorrow.